Farming in the greenhouse helps the farmers to produce at least 16 million tons of cucumber every year. Because of the specialized conditions that are installed in the greenhouses. The concept of vertical farming. Soilless cultivation and the selection of larger cucumber seeds are implemented at the same time. The Netherlands was the only country in 2021 to produce 1.2 million cucumbers because of modern agriculture techniques. and the adoption of modern automated machines that assist the Netherlands farmers from their cultivation to harvesting and then packaging to distributing them into the market. Tech Farm HD has brought both processes together today, where in this very video, we will show you how cucumbers are grown in greenhouses and farms. The process starts with the growth of cucumber seedlings, the seeds will be planted without using soil. Many of the greenhouses prepare their seedlings while some of them purchase them. In order to give support to the seedlings, small sticks are placed as their stand. Once the seedlings are grown, they will be transplanted together. This process will be ready after two weeks when the shape will be ready to be placed at the desired places. Now the seedlings are prepared to be shifted to the planting area which is in abundant number and requires something to be pulled off there. Please give us a thumbs up and indicate which nation you are viewing from in the comment section. Aeroponic Farming Aeroponic farming is an innovative and efficient method of cultivation that revolutionizes traditional agriculture by suspending plant roots in air and delivering nutrients through a fine mist or spray. Unlike traditional soil-based farming, aeroponics eliminates the need for soil altogether, relying on a nutrient-rich solution to nourish plants directly. This method offers several advantages, including faster growth rates, increased yields, and reduced water consumption. In aeroponic systems, plants have unrestricted access to oxygen, allowing for optimal nutrient absorption and promoting vigorous root development. The controlled environment of aeroponic farms also minimizes the risk of soil-borne diseases and pests, contributing to healthier and more resilient crops. One of the key benefits of aeroponic farming is its ability to maximize space utilization. Vertical aeroponic towers and racks enable farmers to cultivate crops in a compact footprint, making it suitable for urban agriculture and areas with limited space. This spatial efficiency, combined with the reduced need for water and soil, positions aeroponic farming as a sustainable and resource-conscious solution for the future of agriculture. As the world faces challenges such as population growth, climate change, and diminishing arable land, Aeroponics emerges as a promising technology that not only addresses these issues, but also presents a pathway to more sustainable and resilient food production systems. Cucumber farming. Three cucumber crops can be grown every year means three times the cucumbers can be harvested each year, and that would be half a million cucumber plants. The size of the farm is very large, and the cold weather conditions like the Netherlands are perfect for such a huge growth. These plants are then grown on biological fiber mats similar to those that were used in the coconut farming video. The farmers have installed a direct water pumping system that streamlines the water flow to the roots of the plants with nutrients mixed with water that will feed the cucumber plants. 
This plant grows well in temperatures that fall between 75 to 85 Fahrenheit, while very sensitive to frost and worms. The plant is very sensitive regarding the supply of nutrients that are to be supplied throughout the growing season. The cucumber plant is tied with a rope as a support to grow. This rope is hung on the upper portion of the greenhouse. This process is carried out right after the plantation. The rope is turned around the plants. This is to ensure that the plant should perfectly grow upwards while the plant is lowered down. This process is done very cautiously and starts right after the plant starts to adopt its shape. Other than this process, some of the farmers utilize the clipping technique, and this process is done in high wire cultivation. Right after three to four weeks of their cultivation, the plants start flowering and producing cucumbers for the first harvest of these cucumber plants. Each plant has the capability to produce dozens of cucumbers. When the production starts, the roots are very well grown on the fiber mats. The greenhouses are covered with night lights so that the growth process doesn't stop even at night. This lighting process is beneficial for plants and helps them to stand still for up to three years. After all the efforts that the farmers put into sowing these cucumber plants, the time to reap the efforts and benefits comes. In simpler terms, the time of harvesting the cucumbers. Now the cucumbers have adopted the perfect shape ranging from 35 to 40 centimeters long and are truly perfect to be harvested. The harvesting process is mostly carried out manually, but with the use of a knife to cut the cucumbers from the stem. Although there are machines that can carry this process with super speed, the farmers have hired laborers who pluck them to avoid the damage that the machine can give to the plants. At the same time, the workers can differentiate between the malgrown cucumbers and throw them right away, which can further be utilized to be served to farm animals. Please, subscribe to the channel for more fascinating videos. Once the harvesting is completed, the cucumbers are taken to the sorting and packaging area. The section is equipped with modern carrying machines that take the cucumbers very cautiously and allocate them under the automated picking machines that pick them with caution. These machines have the ability to sort 25,000 cucumbers each hour quality inspector checks the quality of the cucumbers during the cucumbers are passed on the escalator. The packaging is carried by another set of machines that can pack 6,000 cucumbers each hour. These cucumbers are then packed into various packaging that is further sent to the international and national markets. At the end of the season, it becomes the time to clean up the leftovers of the previous season, which is perfectly carried by automated cutting machines that require only one driver. Each of the plants from the previous season is removed from the greenhouse, while fresh plants are planted instantly until the season is yet to be finished. The roof of the greenhouse is cleaned to ensure that sunlight is passed to the new plants. The windows are washed every week. Cucumber is a prominent ingredient in salad making and is consumed throughout the globe. In the year 2022, it was estimated that the total accumulation of cucumber producing countries was 91,300 billion tons. while China was the largest producing country among others, with the production of 79% of the total. The Netherlands ranked in the fourth position in Europe, preceded by Spain, Turkey, and Poland.